Gordy Grundy, and I'm here to introduce Bob Baker, one of the world's famous marionette puppeteers. Thank you, thank you. Well, you know, we're here for a memory walk about you and the neighborhood, but I gotta tell you about my memory because I grew up with you. Every year I'd see you for a Christmas and Easter presentation down at my hometown. It was the greatest thing, so I'm excited to be here today. <laughs> well, we were all over the place uh, at the very beginning, and still are, in a matter of fact. Uh, we still go down to those same areas sure. uh, during, the, during every year and do different shows. And, uh, <laughs> now, how long have you been here in this space? As of, as, as of the day after Thanksgiving, we, we will have been open 50 years. <laughs> That's amazing. The longest ongoing puppet theater in the United States that has been constantly performing. Fifty years ago, this was a little bit of a different neighborhood, wasn't it? Well, uh, a little bit. The, the, the streetcar has stopped running. The tunnel is across the street. It's right here, they parked a lot of cars across the street here. They had them there. Uh, it was kind of called the Belmont Station. Uh -huh. And. Uh, uh, they had uh, tracks and the cars were there and they have a powerhouse that's over there. Uh, you could go from here, from the subway terminal at, at 4th and Hill, and you would go all the way out, out to uh, Beverly Hills, Hollywood, the valley. And the cars were like any other of the streetcars. Well, they later got to be modernized. But the original ones were the old wooden ones, and then they uh -huh. put the, the metal ones on when the city uh, uh, banned, basically banned the other cars and they couldn't use them. And they built this bridge which was to give the streetcars a right of way. Uh -huh. And First Street was the best way to get downtown from this end of town, the northern part of Los Angeles. Before this bridge was here, my mother used to go to a, 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 a milliner at her home and we used to come down Lucas and there was a, a, a wire fence that made a kind of a circle around and then we went over onto, onto Beverly Boulevard or First or whatever they call that part of the street. I remember that's one of the ways my father used to take me downtown as a kid, come down First Street and over the bridge. But, and then I remember they built the bridge and then people would do that for a right of way for the streetcars to come through. They had a lot of accidents here, that's why. Well, I remember my grandfather used to be the, the staff doctor for the old red car down in Orange County. It still, stopped running 50 still years there. ago? It stopped running about 55. Okay. And everybody says that it was really the fault of, of the automobile people. It, it wasn't. The reason people stopped riding the, the public transportation is gas was 11 cents a gallon or lower. <laughs> I remember when I was a kid, they'd have wars of, of gasoline wars. And, be nine cents, eight cents a gallon. Outrageous. And tires were inexpensive. They have tire wars too. And uh, you could park downtown for 10 cents all day and you had in and out privileges. And that's what really did it. They had to have the automobile because Los Angeles spread out all over the place. 